five, the Tehama County Sheriff wants to cut down on repeat offenders coming and going from the jail like a revolving door. Action News Now reporter Tori Apodaca is live now at the jail. So Tori, how does this new program work? Alan, they are starting the Chronic Offender Program. Basically, it will keep those repeat offenders in jail until trial instead of letting them back out into the community after being arrested. Some of them, really, they do it because it's a pattern for them life. They do it over and over and over. They doesn't know any better. Ahmad El Shanawe sees some people committing the same crimes on these streets in Gerber over and over again. What we're looking at is the person who commits eight or ten petty thefts in a month. The Tehama County Sheriff's Office setting aside nine beds behind these brick walls for chronic repeat offenders, three for each law enforcement agency in the county. Means that we can finally prosecute them, means that they can be held accountable for their actions and they can stop victimizing people in the community. Gerber is actually one of the locations where District Attorney Matt Rogers consistently sees the same person repeating the same crimes. He also sees it happening in Proberta. You know, I can tell you uh, about a defendant that I have personally filed almost 10 cases on at this point, and they're all uh, generally vandalism and, and theft and, and low level property crimes, but they're the kind of crimes that really affect the community. El Shanawe is not so sure putting someone in jail will change them, but he does believe in second chances. Some people really appreciate it. They have second chance and the good, and then some people do doesn't. And this is a program that the sheriff's office has had in the works for quite some time. Now that COVID restrictions are finally lifted, they are able to house more people in the jail. Live in Red Bluff, Tori Apodaca, Action News Now, coverage you can count on. The program will not prevent an arrestee from posting bail to be released.